Now we're going to have some fun. Uh, yesterday, my ego uh, twist came in, okay? And I screwed my clear miser on and nothing happened. This is the first time I've ever had a e-cigarette arrive and there's no voltage in it. Like, the battery is dead. Usually, they're supposed to have 50 or 80% in there, you know, to preserve the battery. This one had nothing. But anyway, so last night, I charged it up. And let's see what happens. Ego twist. The way, uh, even though this is not a review on the ego twist, still, let's have a little fun. It's very hard to see, but if you look, you can see that there are little numbers um, on the metal, which you're not going to see. And then there's this little dot. And you line up the numbers with the dot, and it'll tell you what you're at. And right now, we're at 4.2 volts. Well, let's see what happens when we put it on um, our digital LED tester. Okay, first of all, no load, 4.3, solid, stable, what do you know? Isn't that incredible? Um, the Ego Twist is the first Ego that I've run across where you can actually, it's stable enough that you can test it, you know, on an LED meter. So what's going to happen? I know you're all just waiting to see what happens when we start testing it on the LED meter, right, with the 2.8 clear miser on it. Are you ready? Okay, well, oh, upside down. I don't expect you to read upside down. Well. Oh, 407, 431, 406, 40, 4 whatever. Okay, this voltage is going all over the place. So, this, okay. This, under load, the Ego Twist is not stable, at least from what I'm seeing on my LED test. But the fact that it's PWM means that um, the test may not be accurate, okay? In other words, what's happening is it's fluctuating and maybe it's hitting it, you know, one second later at one, one second at the other, so really, it's actually stable. So I'm gonna need better equipment. But what I can see from this is that the vape that you're going to get from the Ego is not going to be the same vape that you're, from the Ego Twist is not going to be the same vape that you're gonna get from the 14500 because they're reacting differently on the LED digital tester.